Yeah, exactly. Hey, what's up? It's Last Call, the post show. We're back. Yeah, we are. We didn't really go anywhere. Um, Good to see you. Well, yeah, I went to get more water. That's fair. I'm drinking so much water. Good for you. And too. I'm trying to keep my cap. Is your pee clear? Sometimes too clear. I'm like, can't get it like a little bit of spritz of you. You're not eating just enough so you know what it is. Like, you might just be leaking actual water. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, yeah. I'll throw some veggies in there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I've, I've like really packed my fridge now. Well, two things. One, because um, you know my fridge. Yeah. You've been in my house. I have. I finally put up the shelves on the doors. So there's. So now instead of having all the trulies in the middle, you can actually middle, have them on the sides of the, the doors. Sides with the, yeah, the juices. Mm -hmm. and, yeah. Careful with that. I busted one of my shelves because I was loading it up with too much. Uh, I have done that as well at my parents' house. Mm. Damn. Okay. Noted. I don't want to mess that up. Yeah. So that is um, a thing. I would t oh, now I'm stuck on that. Fuck. Anyways, but yes, no, I've been like, I don't know. There's like a handful of things I'm just trying to like change up. One of the things is like drink a ton of water. Mm -hmm. um, eat happy. at home more. Oh. Whether it's like, I'm little by little. Like, I'm not gonna commit myself to being like super healthy, but as long as I'm like eating at home, because one, it's less expensive, and two, it is. it's uh, healthier. A lot of the stuff mm -hmm. I have is at home is yeah. healthier. Just because My I'm like, oh, I love these things. My freezer snacks. is full of meats. So many meats. Like, I have ribs in there, I have ground turkey in there, I have Ooh. steak in there, I have turkey wings in there, like, a whole bunch of meats. I just, uh, cooking though, it's, cause when you have to figure out what you want, and yeah. I'm, I'm currently at the stage in my life where I've done so much cravings for like for the past, when I first moved to Austin, yeah. I always like got things I was craving. So now I'm not really craving anything. You used so, to the Austin stuff, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. So to want to cook when I don't even know what I want to eat is hard. True. Yeah. Especially just with a little bit of time that we get to finally relax after a long day. Just get a kick ass girlfriend who's like a, a really good cook. Damn. Yeah. Damn. You can do a lot of things in return for her. And then it all Blaine just out. said, stop being single as fuck, Kai. Yeah. That's all, that's that's all there is to it. Yeah. Or wait until Elon Musk has one of those AI robots that do stuff for you and you have a robot. Who paying for that? It'll, it'll be good. Yeah. Actually, there is, Elon. like, they have those, uh, those, like, microwave meals that you send to your house. And, like, I know that that mm -hmm. sounds, like, super unhealthy, but there's, like, a local one, and they send you shit, and it's, like, all locally sourced vegetables and meats and it's not bad. The problem is that I'm also like kind of picky and I've done sure. like the delivery places like mm -hmm. um I, I, just, I just when they send you the meal prep and everything oh, yeah, yeah. and it's just I'll be honest sometimes it can be a little bland. Yeah, okay. I get that. Well, that's well, what you do is that you 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 pick and choose like your favorite recipes mm -hmm. and then you just add your own spice up to it. I like yeah. those simply because it teaches me how the fuck to cook. And it has all the stuff prepped yeah, for me. I learned how to make uh, scallops. I do not. Ooh, see. Really good. I yeah. the, the difference is I added Obey to my recipe. They did it. Mm. How do you make scallops without Obey? That shit don't make sense. Well, I mean, like that's what I'm saying. Like you take those. I, I don't know. Like Lindsay takes the ones that they love and they put them in a booklet, and then they just Pulled write little out. notes yeah. and mm -hmm. like notes of like. Oh, what so they they're making add, their right? own recipe. That's book what I'm saying, and that's hella smart. But I don't have time to do that shit. Yeah. Yeah. I wake up at seven. You I think take Lindsay her... has time to do that shit? They a whole mom. True. True. But you make time for the things you want to make time for. Uh, but they don't also stream. It's true. They don't stream. They have two kids, yes, which is a lot. But when you have your kids and nanny, you could maybe like break off and do some cooking and stuff. I can't be in the middle of stream like I'll be back in. Then 10 minutes, guys, intermission, uh, daddy's gonna go cook real quick. <laughs> like that, boom, goodbye. Fair. Yeah. That's the thing, it's like, like wake up at seven, deal with Gabu, um, then I have the Uber to work because I'm waiting to get my car, yeah. and then go to work, come back, Gabu again, stream, then cut my stream off like as, as soon as I can, so then that way I can spend some time with Jackie, and now that Jackie's a nurse, she starts at like seven in the morning. Mm -hmm. So we need to be in bed. I end my stream at like nine, nine thirty. We need to be in bed by like ten thirty. But I got a walk boot. I got to work my back out because, you know, I have back issues. And then I also got to shower, get clean, all that kind of stuff. And by, and, and by the time that happens, it's already 12. Yeah. And so I'm like, fuck, man, I want to cook. I want to cook. I just don't have time right now. A new uh, thing that's been introduced in my like schedule, my regimen, is obviously I, I still love working out, uh, and I'm recovering from because I blew out my bicep. Yeah. Um, and 8 a.m. every morning for the past like two or three weeks, Eric Bedore's been coming over to my house, and we've just been lifting together. So I'm like getting him up, getting him in shape and shit. Fuck, that's awesome. He's killing it. I'm so proud of him. God, what? Can yeah. someone help me? I want to start working out. I'm tired of feeling like shit, but 
it's just not fun for me. It's, and I need someone to hold me accountable. Mm. Yeah, a lot of people need that. I think there's a lot of up and, like, you just got to be, like, you just got to do it yourself a lot of the way. There's a lot of self-motivation because, I mean, he's got to get up every morning out of bed and yeah. drive over to my place. Yeah, I think, I think that's it because it's the same thing. Like, we were talking about, like, school and, and the mm -hmm. real power. It's the same thing where I'm, like, someone else can be telling me to do this and, like, you do this. Be, be, be better. Like, a personal trainer have no effect on me because I would just sit there and be like, no. Nope. Yeah, no. That's, uh, that's all right. I, you're, you're, you're not going to kill me. So I, I think it's a matter of like, uh, James said this ages ago, James Williams from Funhouse said this mm -hmm. ages ago and it stuck with me. It's like, you just gotta treat exercise like brushing your teeth. It's not like a negotiable like, oh, I gotta, I gotta make time for that later. It's just like, no, it's just like part of your daily regimen. Mm -hmm. You just gotta do that thing. One thing yeah. too is like, you'll never, you'll never work out and go, why the fuck did I do that? Oh yeah. Well, uh, well, when you, when you tear a bicep, you might well, be that, thinking otherwise. That's a whole nother thing. But in terms of like when you actually know. just go and you work out, it's like I don't know, Fredo. I've had plenty of times where I, I attempted to work out and then at the end I said, Why the fuck did I do that? And then oh, I don't know. <laughs> 99 point nine percent of the time. Ninety nine point nine percent of the time you're like, you yes, go to the gym, better now. You, you never come out going, ah, I wasted my time or yeah. like oh, I feel like shit. You always come out going, Damn, I feel good. And then and then you know, you cross any reflection obviously and you just kinda go, there's a little something there, there's a little something there, maybe not. My big one is like I'll be crossing by and I'll be like Oh, damn, damn, like I. See, that's the problem is I already have a banging body without uh, working out, so. You, you can have a banging body, you can not have a banging body, as long as you're happy, that's all that matters. Yeah. yeah. Mm. I, th I think that, that there's like a, I was actually talking to my therapist about this, but like there's like I think a relationship with physical fitness and body positivity where you can like say you're not in peak physical condition, you skip yeah. six months of working out, you don't have to feel like a piece of shit for it and stuff, but there's also another part where it's like, you're looking past the, f the needs that your body has of like, oh, I, I should probably be able to climb some stairs without fucking yeah. dying. Yeah. There's like a, there's like a uh, line that you gotta yeah. tow. Yeah, it's just, I think it's also because, you know, as a girl, you kind of get raised being like treadmill, cardio, flexibility mm. kind of thing. So. Like, I know if I did want to get into it, I want to get into lifting weights. Hell yeah. That's how you essentially, you know, so you keep toned. the body form, but you're toned, you're toned and you're not as tired. I just, I have no knowledge on that. And I've read too many stories about how people get hurt doing yeah. that because they don't yeah. do it correctly. Does it, like, even when I was doing Ring Fit Adventure, I was, because I was doing that like daily or every other day. Warm over everything. That's yeah. the problem. Apparently, I was doing squats wrong, and it wasn't until two weeks into me starting Ring Fit that my friends were telling me that. Mm. Like, I mean, yeah. I will say though, like when I was me, I when I was in my early to mid twenties, which is where you're at now, mm -hmm. your body will definitely recover from a lot more injuries than when you're up like in your thirties, like I am. So like there there is some wiggle room where you'll be okay. But I mean at that point right. just get a professional. Get a there there professional. are a lot of well established fitness content creators. Um, there are also a lot of really good apps as well um, that teach form back to front. And if you really want to lock it in, yeah, like Blaine said, get like a, a trainer. They're pretty expensive, but you could do a trainer for like six months. That way you get you through a yourself. routine of three months and yeah. then a routine of another three months. And then you take that and you just cycle Which, those routines. Getting those fundamentals down yeah. is yeah. a huge thing too. It's super yeah. important. I think it's all still for those points. It's just like you already feel like you have no time for yourself to do the things that you really want yeah. to do. But I do, I do want to start feeling better about my days and not just like I'm going through the motions because mm -hmm. those are the, that's the easiest way to get into depression. It's just yeah. feeling like you're going through what you have to. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And just like working out, one, you, you feel good about yourself, your body feels good, and it just, you just come out of it going, all right, fuck yeah, like, all right, let me, let me go fucking do the rest of the day. You got a lot of energy from it. Yeah. One thing I started doing um, a lot of <laughs> is, um, is I, I realized... I was that person, as much as I like being clean and taking care of things, I was very much also a person that was very much like, um, like, oh, I can do that later. And so for the past like two weeks, I've been going, nope, I can do that now. And boy, oh boy, so many fucking like little things are like, I gotta call this or I gotta pay that bill. Or like there's, uh, my neighbor did their roof and so there's shit like in my lawn and I gotta get to that that just linger with you for yeah. days and weeks. And it just stacks up. It and becomes stacks up. And it becomes really fucks with like, last night, I was like, <clears throat> like, okay, like, I got to get up at 7. I'm going to 
like there's a ton of things I can go, I can do that later. And I was like, I'm gonna take 15 minutes to get rid of like half of the shit on my mental list. And then I just did it. And then Jackie was like, you know what? I'm gonna do it too. And then Jackie did a bunch of stuff. And I went to bed just being like, I got shit done in 15 minutes that I would have sat with for weeks. And I was like, like so I kinda, I'm kind of liking that. I, yeah. I learned something from a writing partner that if you use things, like little treats to motivate yourself, then mm. that helps. Like I have a personal project that I don't wanna speak about too much, but once the I reach the end of that rainbow, I'm gonna buy myself an old like N64, you know? Nice. And I'm very excited about that and I want that fucking thing now, so I'm just gonna get it done quicker. Yeah. So your reward system's fun. Yeah, because otherwise, like Kai said, you, you get stuck in the motions. You yeah. kinda just go, all right, I'm gonna do this, and then the next thing, and then the next thing. And then yeah. obviously like taking time to yourself is like yeah. super I'm super important. stressed this it week is, yeah. with everything going on. My birthday charity stream happening, but my parents flying in, so I have to clean up my house because I'm not allowed to have a dirty house when my mom's here. Absolutely nope. not. <laughs> mm -mm. Oh, Jesus Christ. See, that's the thing. I, I, that doesn't even occur to me if my parents ever come. Because I'm like, yeah, my house is dirty. It won't be when they leave. <laughs> like, she, she'll look at it and she'll be like, Matthew, we've got to do something about this. I'm like, oh, I just am so busy. I'm so I got that so busy. Too. And so then terrible. it'll, it'll mm -hmm. get done, you know? Mm -hmm. Nah, my mom will she'll beat complain. my ass. <laughs> She'll be like, this is really how you expected me to come? Yeah. I got to wash my sheets. Ah, oh, so much uh, that I have to do. The I'm supposed to stream tonight. With what time? Kai, it just, they won't kill you. That's that's how it works. That's literally in my head. I'm like, oh, Maybe not me. physically. It's the slow Fine. death, though, Matt. Maybe not physically. I mean, you know, you know, my mom called time, me yeah, and yelled true. at me to make sure. <laughs> I don't know me. <laughs> this weekend, my mom literally called me to yell at me to make sure I had Diet Cokes in the fridge for her. Oh, yeah? Because I should know better than not having Diet Cokes in the fridge. Wow. All right. That's... If, if my mom called me and said, you better have like this in the fridge when I get there, we would be getting it when she got here. Mm. And I would just be like, oh, I mean, it I mean, wasn't a priority for me. You're also, yeah, you're the one drinking it. You can ask them to like quick stay at b and You can do that. Good. You just tell them like, hey, why don't you, I think it'd be easier if you were to stay at like a, the hotel that's down the street. I was like, I don't think that's an option. No? That's, that's, that's based like, on your face, I don't think it is. I, I asked them if they wanted to come down for no. Christmas and they were like, yeah, and I've got like two spare rooms. I was like, yeah, you can just stay in there. And they're like, yeah, but we, we should probably get like a hotel or something, right? I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, no, that's, no. Yeah. We're, we're the kind of family that like, cause my grandmother has four children and they all have children. We're the kind of family, like if we can all fit in the same house to yeah. like for the holidays, will. we will. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. I get sure. that. And that's, that's generally how we are too, but that's just because it's like, hey, it's my parents. And my sister. Yeah, it doesn't seem make, like. And my grandparents wouldn't dare leave, so mm. they're 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 old and they're like those people where it's like we could have a health problem at any moment. Mm. That now they they won't they won't at all. They're very healthy like for their tanks, age. Yeah. But my grandma is like it, it, any, any second, second, any second, and I would be miles away from my doctor, and I don't want to be any, I, I, got, I got to be near it. I'm like, you love that man more than my grandpa, don't <laughs> oh my you? Oh my God. You, you want, you want to, to stay with him more than I my need grandpa. need my doctor, the hey, doctor. It's, it's, it's crazy. I don't know, maybe one day I'll be old and think like that, but man, I'm like. I hope not for your sake, because that's a scary yeah, I don't, trap. Like, that's, that's like people who don't leave their hometowns, because it's like, what if this happens? And it's like, well, yeah, but yeah. you can go to Japan. That, that'd be cool. And that's, that's like exactly yeah. the thing. Like, my, my family just hasn't done that. That's a like, I mean, my, my, my family's the same way. I think yeah. me traveling more has opened up the, that door for my family. And they're more like, oh, well, maybe flight planes aren't so scary. Yeah. You know? mm. Well, like my grandparents, they used to travel all the time. But again, short and short. Then they got they got old, and then they were just like, I'm trying to yeah. see how low I, I can go anyway. I'm in pain. You what? I'm trying to see how low I can go before I'm in pain. And it doesn't hurt yet. But you're like, you're really chillier. Like you can do the splits. I used to be able to drop down into it. Not anymore. Just Why am I doing this? Fuck plane. me. Plane. You got really low. You mess no. up your arm. You don't need to mess up your growing. Keep you going help. lower. Uh, no, help. I got it. I got it, Kai. I got this. I, it's not, I'm not going any lower. <laughs> he can go low. I don't know. Well, he can go low. We just go low. It's just jump. Push but can, if, you, if I just cock my hips, when I can just go into nope. the... You know. This floor is also slippery. It's going to be hard That's to true. get back up. I challenge Alfredo to a limbo contest, everyone. And Trevor. Like right now, or you have? I have traveled. I have challenged them because they're just so fucking tall. For why? For why? why? What you mean for why? You mean know what I'm saying? That's my family. Go lower than this arm. Family it's built high. this way. This is my arm. That's, that's simple. There you go. You can hear my sternum. Yeah, I did. I did hear the, I did hear the crack. I heard the pop. You see, that's that old. That's All right, but now put your arm up. Come on. My arm up. For me to go under. 
Well, well it's kind of cheating. Mean, you want to lower? There you go. Nothing. Okay, let me let me get let me give me. Yeah, no, I'm Thank gonna take you. a fattest L. And that's on that without one. working out. I'm gonna take the fattest <laughs> Imagine L. Imagine if I actually tried to be flexible. Oh, with that L, I'm off. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> Well, if you guys want any flexibility lessons, away. clearly I'm a pro. I got you. I'm fine. Can't do anything else. Can't lift weights, but I can I can bend a bit. I wonder if you want to lift weights. We can lift weights. What, but I want to lift weights. Teach me to lift weights. Let's go talk about it. What if talk, we leave? This will is how will we I be show? Right. near my doctor? I don't know. Oh, I'm going to go find him. Oh, spooky.